I'm here in the Aldo Leopold picnic area and vista in the Gila National Forest near the mud hut. Aldo Leopold was a famous naturalist and ecologist who came here as one of the early forest rangers working for the United States Forest Service. In 1909, when he began his career as a forest ranger, he conducted a survey of the territories, not yet states, territories of Arizona and New Mexico. And what he found was there were only six areas large enough to be called wilderness. For him, wilderness is a place that he could ride a horse for two weeks without coming across any signs of humanity. More generally speaking, wilderness is an area that is untouched by towns or clear cuts or other indications that hum human beings have put their foot profoundly on the site. He found six such areas of a half million acres or larger in 1909. He conducted the survey again 10 years later in 1919. By this time, it was the states of Arizona and New Mexico. And instead of six areas of a half million acres or larger that could be called wilderness, there was one, this one, the Gila. It was the Gila National Forest. He began immediately to create a wilderness system, a designated wilderness system, where by definition, humans are visitors. They don't stay. And 16 years after his death, in 1964, the Gila was designated the first wilderness area in the world by the United States Wilderness Act. Leopold died in 1948, fighting a grass fire on a neighbor's property. Remember, at the edge of extinction, only love remains.